Western Bulldogs examines image showing Bailey Smith holding a bag of white powder. Star Western Bulldogs midfielder Bailey Smith has admitted to misbehaving in late 2021 during which he was deeply embarrassed after an image was posted to social media on Saturday showing him holding a small plastic bag filled with white powder. A separate video later emerged showing Smith smelling an unidentified substance at the party before wiping his nose as a female voice saying, I need a straw. The club issued a statement on Saturday afternoon in response to social media content citing an illegal substance. Western Bulldogs CEO Amit Bings and Smith were quoted in a statement as expressing their disappointment and regret. Sources familiar with Smith's situation have confirmed that the photo was taken late last year at a time when he was taking a mental break from pre-season training, while the video was also shot between last season and this year. The 21-year-old who was played 77 games is one of the AFL's biggest stars with a huge following on social media and marketing. He has been an ambassador for the cotton on clothing community and has appeared in Kayo's Your Team's campaign. The repentant Smith vowed Saturday to learn lessons from the past and be a better person in the future. Smith apologized to fans, his family, teammates, club and league and sponsors with Bain saying that while the club has not yet apologized for the Smith's behavior, it is now their responsibility to ensure the health and protection of the welfare of players. Bailey managed to take steps to ensure he can manage his mental health and make strong decisions while still performing well on the pitch. That was reflected in his strong performance on the pitch during the 2022 AFL season, Baines said. The club has supported Bailey through this process and we will continue to work with him and give him the support he needs as he continues his career as a Bulldogs player. The Bulldogs and the AFL's Department of Integrity will continue to investigate the images and videos and Smith is likely to be fined. Under AFL's policy on illicit drugs, which is currently under revision, players are hair tested during the off-season and clubs receive unidentified data describing the number of positive tests and the types of drugs used. However, the player does not receive a strike. The information may be used to target teasers during the season and all positive tests during the season are subject to the drug policy, otherwise on match days. If a player tests positive for a banned substance on a match day, he is subject to World Anti-Doping Agency regulations. If the substance is illegal but not increased potency, they can get a three-month ban. On Saturday, sources were unable to confirm the origin of the photos and the club are trying to piece together the exact details before deciding what action to take. James Ruckman Shane Mumford was fined $25,000 and two, and two games when a video of him snorting was released in late 2018. Thanks.